She's literally a prostitute, has my husband's phone, and she's trying to sell it at the Yuko ATM. You don't mind if I take a look, do you? Wow. That's all I can say so far. Wow. This escalated very quickly. Hey, everybody. In today's video, we're going to be reacting to a channel called Columbus Police Body Cam, and they're out of Columbus, Ohio. The video we're going to be reacting to today is called Officers Catch Shoplifter Packing a Lot of Meat. Let's check it out. That's us calling you back. Yep. What's going on? Um, so... Officers were dispatched on a call about a stolen cell phone that was tracked to this location. My husband is in jail. Um, this, she's literally a prostitute, has my husband's phone, and she's trying to sell it at the Yuko ATM. How do you know she has this phone? I tracked it here, and she answered it before I turned it off. So I turned it off, like, what? through T-Mobile, and... Wait, how does she know that it's here is way less relevant question to how do you know she's a prostitute <laughs> it's secured so i can unlock it okay and everything how do you know that it's uh how do you know this woman um <laughs> he's avoiding saying the thing he knows her through drugs and that he's in jail for him screaming. notice she didn't say dealer she said <laughs> drugs and that he's in jail for him screwing her in my house. I'm sorry to hear that. Yeah. So, Nobody deserves that, right? Yeah. Uh, he's like, okay, well, I walked into it. Yes. Um, Sounds like a piece of work. Okay. Um, this, I've been with him for 19 years, the drugs, and I think there's something mental with him. And all right. just let me pull up is, over here. We'll he go inside. Not him. So not acting like I himself, just right? I want my stuff that me and him work for sold. I got gotcha. you. What she wow, that's all I can say so far. Wow, this escalated very quickly. Look like she's taller than me. She's got red hair. It's up in a ponytail, but it's folded over. Go bright um, red or just like red, like, like orangey red. Like uh, natural red hair color. Okay. How'd she get the phone? He gave it to her before he went to jail, but she's not supposed to be selling it. Mm -hmm. Is it shared property or who's it? You guys had it together, I assume. You guys yeah, are married. Yeah, we're on the same. You think phone. she has it with her right now? Yeah, she's trying to sell. It. What's her name? Oh my God, what a situation! Nine the property room. Hey, Joe. Oh, they got her. You're Erica. Yeah. It looks you like also a D. Known as D. I don't know. D. Do you have a phone that belongs to the woman up front that no. we can just get back to her? I don't have a phone. No. No, I don't have a phone. It's hard to complete. I don't have a phone. I don't even have a phone. You're not even What are you doing? Buying some food? Where's yeah. Taz? Where's your boy Taz at? I don't have Taz no more. You don't mess with him? I don't mess with Taz. You can have a phone. It says, shop liver caught packing a lot of meat. How does this have anything to do with the phone? Yeah. Is it Taz's phone? Oh, I don't know. I, I wonder if that's... What just fell? You go by D sometimes. Yeah. Did y'all just see something fall? What is what fell? Is Taz in jail right now? Yeah. So you aren't with him? No. He's with some other girl. And man. Right. And man. Is she a big girl? Is she with another girl? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's with another girl. It's like she kind of a big girl. No. <laughs> oh my God! What a triangle we're in. Brown hair, straight brown hair. Let me see where. Uh, I, I don't mess with Taz. You don't mind if I take a look for you? I don't have a phone. Empty your bag for me. Yeah, I can take the stuff you have. Yeah. I've got okay. good old Verizon cell phone service not working out here. Does that mean you shut it off? No. Wait, he said empty your bag. She's pulling me out of her bag. Oh. No, it's just right. shitty signal. Yeah, don't get out. Don't get out. What's with all these snakes? You guys are. Put that out. Put that out. What's our call uh, name again? Uh, my mom. Jamie. How am I so lost? I feel like I'm completely lost. Thanks. What'd you say Taz's new girlfriend's name is? Amanda. Okay. I don't know her last name. Okay. She described you. 
Yo, are you just holding on to Taz's phone while he's in jail? We're just double checking. You, you definitely have. Hey, you, what's this? No, this is not a steak. Well, can, are you stealing steaks? No, not stealing steaks. Ah! Give me a break. Oh my god. Crack pipes falling out all over the place. Oh my gosh, is this the craziest video I've ever seen? No, this is oh my god, she's got steak in her pants. No, you're that's what I do. You keep me crunched. You were trying to steal steaks. Oh my god. She was pulling food out of her bag too. He said, empty your bag, and she's like starts pulling meat out of her bag. Something there. All right, I got another one. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have a phone. I'm not gonna. I don't have a phone. What are you doing? I don't, I don't think Eric is your real name. You don't prostitute no more, so you don't know what to do. I'm not sure you can find. Young lady, can we borrow your help here for a minute? Do you guys still have the loss prevention people here? Oh, I'm not sure. Obviously not, because this lady just stole about eighty dollars worth of steaks. I can find that for you. We just pulled a bunch of these steaks out of her pants. Yeah, we're pants. looking for something else, but she had to pull some steaks down the shore. So. <laughs> and a crack pipe, I guess. Convince her to put them back. We just don't know what your policy is. I don't think you want them on the show. Yeah. Uh, uh, but is LP here, though? I'm not sure. I can find out for you. Give me one second, okay? Yeah. What a crazy, crazy What's thing. your name? What's your real name? Erica. It's Erica. Erica. That is right, Erica. I don't remember. What's your last name? What? What? what is Okay, it did say her name, but I blurred it out. What's your social? Where's that? My mom's. Well, you just got caught stealing. I'm stealing. I do that stuff all the time. You got twelve dollars a pop. You got you know over forty dollars in merchandise. What's your phone number? It's more than that because she pulled more out of her bag before her pants. Uh, the contact number. Is you got any warrants or anything right now? Oh yes, thank you. Why haven't we recovered the crack pipe and just left it on the ground? We don't need security. <laughs> yeah, loss prevention would be better. I like security is worthless. How are you going to put this he down? He said security is worthless. You're going to pay for part of it and steal the rest of it? Stop it. Do we do we look like we're a couple of 12 year olds? So you buy this and you steal that? What do you do? So why is this floating around in your car? He's blurring out his notepad if you're curious. Good, how are you? Good, I'm Drew, nice to meet you. Bro, you're giving me a bad name, man. You can't walk out here with the name Drew after you sit there and let this lady shove $80 worth of meat in her purse in her bag. You're not even representing this. Hey. So she had, uh, so three or four daughter things. Three. She's one on each side and one down the front. She's I've never been here. I don't know which one was down the front. Have, but um, the girl that looked like me got a, a cross over. Uh, it's her, her fault. Well, we're here for something completely uh, different. Okay. We just happened to notice she had large pieces of meat in her pants. There's a notebook of fun. This guy's like super sketchy too. He's like not making eye contact with anybody. He's just like staring down. Like this is weird. Erica, you hear that? You're not welcome yeah, back here. It sounds like you might have been already before. But, I mean, from this point forward, you acknowledge that, right? I'm, I'm, I'm it's in front of all these yeah. personnel here, right? Yeah. This is salvageable if you just rewrap them, but they might have been on bare skin, so I don't know how I would proceed with caution. Yeah, we're going to go ahead and uh, get rid of them. I'd throw them in the incinerator. Yeah. <laughs> he said I'd throw them in the incinerator. And I can't guarantee that there won't be some. <laughs> oh my god, this dude's a savage. Bro, you can't even say that, can you? Exactly. Oh my gosh, this dude's like, is, did he really just say that? 
<laughs> oh. Eric, you know better than this. I know. <laughs> Lots of people looking for help. All you gotta do is take a shower, get dressed, go to work. Hold the back. I'll get your report number up front. Yeah. She said, I won't come back. I won't come back. She thinks she's about to get out of here without getting arrested. No, you're getting arrested. Surely you're getting arrested. You're off the side of your phone. Oh, no, there's just a full I think of rock in my kitchen to the CPD. Usually the crackers are open. She's already been eating the crackers. She's probably just hungry, but come on, man. Everything's your life right. right here. Here. Yep, you can take the crackers. Everything else is staying right here. All our yeah, yeah, reports yeah. up there. That's all the criminal trespass <laughs> warrant. And you can just go out and install everything. Um, what you just have to do, you have it. So I'll give you the report number up front. Yeah, you can stick with half. And then I'll do it. Yep. We're, you, this is all yours. And then, yeah, and then these ones are all in your pants right here. This one wasn't. The, little ones. the big one was still in the basket. Okay. So the little ones were shoved on. Oh, thank you very much. We'll get rid of the little ones. Thank you, guys. Let's go up front. They're going to put them back on the shelf, 100%. Thanks for all you Thank you. Thank you. Everything you said has been a lie so far. So you're not coming back. You had steaks in your pants. <laughs> you're packing some serious meat. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> we used to have like a Kroger where I grew up and it was exactly like this. Is this a Kroger? I think it's a Kroger. You don't think this random person yeah. she's like hiding in storage somewhere. So. Guys. <clears throat> Can you clear this code two and put us back on a shoplifter at the same location? We found a young lady packing serious meat in her <laughs> Oh my God, he called it in on the radio like that. What a legend. Okay. <laughs> 1231. Is that, is that D? 1231. Okay. We don't think that she's in here unless she's like hiding in storage somewhere, so. Um, or in the bathroom. Yeah. It's not, it's not even the girl. Oh my gosh. It's not even the lady with the cell phone. She really didn't have a cell phone. This is the craziest video ever. We have to deal with her for a minute, then we'll get with you. All right, we'll be here. Uh, uh, All right, young lady, just stand over here in the shade. This lady outside told on this lady without even knowing she was stealing. Oh my gosh! Is it E R I C A or K? A A R I C K A. He's all calling her a prostitute because he thinks that the lady. Oh my god! This is so crazy. He's like calling her a prostitute and saying that the meat is like got to be sent to an incinerator and it's not even the same girl. Oh my god! Oh my god. No, I thought it was an E. Give me one minute, sir. Thank you. What's your last oh name? my. What's your social? What's your date of birth? I didn't even say anything about the crack pipe. I never even saw him pick it up or anything. Erica. All right, young lady, stand by. We'll get you going here in a minute. Hello. You understand? If you come back here now, you'd be arrested for trespassing. Now that you've been notified, I wouldn't. I would find a new um, grocery store. That'd be a good idea. Okay. Yeah. You can't make decisions like this. This is not good. I, see that. I know that you don't want to be a, you know, do what you were doing before, but you, you definitely can't. He do still it. called her a prostitute. And it's not even the same girl. Oh my God. Oh, you got to generate some income somewhere else. I know. You live with your mom. You still contact with your mom? Yeah. Okay. Well then, why don't you go take a shower? Get dressed up and go put some applications in. Yeah. There's, there's plenty of people looking to hire people. I mean, it's cold, but it's the truth. You know what I mean? It's just. Oh. Did you ever end up having. Uh, you were pregnant a couple years ago? Mm -hmm. Okay, hold on. They're both prostitutes. 
What? Oh, gosh. Ohio, what is going on up there? Where's she at? It's going to be the report number. And I put her name on the other side of that. Right no, I put I put the suspect's name on it so you can put it on your records. <laughs> uh, we didn't find her. I, I don't. There's somebody in the bathroom. But... Okay, we're we. This girl was, was trying to steal a bunch of meat, so we got stuck on that. But yeah, I mean, they did just completely stop looking for the cell phone. They like show up for a cell phone, find a lady with a bunch of meat, and they're like, eh, who cares about the cell phone? We got meat in here. Yeah, sorry about your phone problem. Sorry about your phone problem. This is why you're here, officer. Officer, you're here because I tracked my stolen phone to this property. Oh my goodness. Thanks, dude. <laughs> Excellent on the air. He said, sorry about your phone problem. I'm still not doing stupid shit. Perfect. It was just perfect. <laughs> All right, so you're good. Stay away from this business. Do not come back in here. You'll be trespassed. You'll be taken to jail next time. That's the best we can do for you. All right? Well, good luck to you. Go find some. They're letting her go. Somewhere else to hang out. Well, okay, here's the thing. She technically didn't steal until she walked out the door with it, I think. So maybe that's why they're not arresting her is because she actually didn't steal it. But I think once you put it in your pants, I mean, that's pretty much stealing. But either way, didn't you say a crack pipe fell out on the floor? Like, how is this lady not going to jail? No wonder you got freaking this in the streets. Get yourself a job. Uh, uh, Pay for your stakes. Uh, don't pack them down your pants, right? Please don't say nothing to me if you see me on the street. Please don't. Do what? Please don't say nothing to me if you make fun of me on the street and you see me. Hey, I mean, that that's real talk, dude. She's like, she said, please don't make fun of me if you see me on the streets. Like, he is kind of like berating her right now. Okay, bro, you went too far. Either put her in jail or let her go on her way. Right. I'm not going to make fun of you now. Yeah. I mean, I hardly ever see you anymore, right? Right. All right, be careful. All right, guys, they got into my emotions a little bit at the end. He was kind of berating her. You know, that was a little too much, but what an insane video. Two ladies of the night, stolen cell phones, stolen meat. Crack pipes, no arrest made. Sorry about your phone. Like, this is the craziest thing. Mel from Simple Life Acclaim said that she always wants to know what the comments were in the video that I'm reacting to. So let's go down to the comments and see what everybody else had to say about this. All right, guys, let's read some of these comments. I said, I lost it. The cops had no idea what kind of individual they were going to meet on this day. <laughs> okay, come on. Dang, Erica, you got crack pipes falling all over the place, yet she only embarrassed about the meat she got, got caught trying to steal. Man, these officers were on a serious stakeout. <laughs> come on, dude, come on. I like how the cops said, go take a shower and get dressed to go fill out applications. That's good, great advice. I mean, it really is good advice. That's, that's the path towards a better life for this lady. The dispatcher's little giggle when the officer said, we have a female shoplifter packing some serious meat in her pants. Absolutely killed me. No, she's in cuffs for packing meat. I can't with these side comments from these officers. The cop telling the workers to throw the meat into an incinerator but still might not work. <laughs> How embarrassing. That is terribly embarrassing. The stakes were high on this one. Oh, man. All right, guys, if you enjoyed the video, maybe check out this video and come back tomorrow because we'll watch something else. See you.